Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm Kevin and today I'm going to be doing a real world test of the miles per gallon while towing with my Ford Maverick. I have a 22 Ford Maverick right here and behind me I have uh, an equipment trailer. I have my Polaris Ranger and behind that I have my little Great Dane uh, stand up riding lawnmower. So even with putting the Great Dane all the way to the back of the trailer behind the rear axle, I got the Ranger pushed back all the way. The tires are touching. There's still quite a bit of tongue weight. As you can see the truck is squatting. A significant amount but it's gonna be just fine so I'm gonna go ahead and start the truck up as you can see I got just under 30,000 miles got the little Maverick guy right there it knows there's a trailer connected it's got automatic trailer brakes right there all right so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in tow mode so right down here you're gonna push this Now it's in tow haul. All right, we're gonna go to a gas station. I'm gonna top off with gas and I'm gonna clear out the uh, fuel mileage. So I topped off the gas. Now I'm going to clear out the average fuel mileage. And I'm about to get on interstate. So I'm gonna be doing about 85 miles and it's gonna be almost half and half between interstate and back roads. So I'll be on interstate four and interstate uh, 75. I'll see what the fuel mileage is gonna be on the interstate and then uh, I'll pick it back up whenever we're on the back roads and I'll see what it is on the back roads and then we'll look at the average for the whole trip. So I made it to my destination at Casey's Cove in beautiful Homa Sassa Springs, right here on the water. Still got the side-by-side -side and the uh, lawnmower on the trailer, nothing fell off. And I think, and it worked out in my favor actually, when I put the destination in the GPS, there was a really bad accident as there always is on I-4 and 75. So I ended up just taking I-4 for about six or seven miles and getting on 98 and taking the back roads here. So I had the cruise control set between 55 and 65 um, on just the various back roads. And uh, I think I actually worked out. I ended up averaging like 14.6. So I'm about to go in the truck right now and bring it up on display just to show you guys. All right, so right there, 14.6. That's what I averaged for about a two hour drive. I think it was uh, like 65 to 80 miles. Don't really remember. It routed me a couple of different times. So I'm not exactly sure how many miles it was, but it was two hours of driving at uh, highway speeds, so that's not bad. Um, my old Tacoma got that without pulling a trailer, so I can't complain that the little Ford Maverick um, pulling a heavy duty trailer, uh, a side-by-side, -side, and a lawnmower got 14.6.